Welcome everyone, here it is at long last. It's the start of the NBA regular season. I know every opening day of the regular season, Grant. Nothing quite like this first one of the year. You know, as a former player, you know firsthand that there's so much anticipation and hard work that goes into making it to opening day. So everyone right now is on a level playing field and the dream is still alive. So let's take a look at the Phoenix Suns starting lineup. All the stars on the floor for the Suns. Booker and Beal, the backcourt. KD up front. Josh Okogie is out there with DeAndre Ayton. Richard Kevin Durant has been a big-time scorer in the NBA since he stepped onto the hardwood. No, and I played against him as a rookie. And let me tell you, even the veteran team that we had, we knew that this guy was going to be a bucket getter for a long time. Giddy passes to Gilgis Alexander. Shot that time, not on target. Booker with the defensive effort to the paint. Pass to Okogi. Releases from 15. The kick to Durant. Three-pointer. Kept alive. Aiden passes to Durant. Shoots over Holmgren. That's good from Durant. On the assist by Aiden. And the dime going to Aiden, expanding the passing part of his game. And so it's Gilgis Alexander with it. He brings it up for the Thunder. Four-point game. To the middle. Oh, got a piece of it. Pass to Holmgren. Clock at six. Booker against Giddy. Durant pulls it in. Maybe he thinks he has that type of range, but I don't think his coaches will agree. Yeah, and you're not going to just have the green light for long if you're chucking up bombs like that. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Holmgren with a screen on Booker. Gilgis Alexander passes to Holmgren. Missed inside. The Suns have gone just two for four from the floor. It's Durant with a drive. And it's slammed in by Durant. You can really feel the momentum swinging in their direction. Yeah, but they can't relax. They've got to keep building on this lead because it is not safe. Pass to Williams. To halt the run. That one's good. And so Gilgis Alexander with the assist. The defense gives Shea all their attention, and that leaves another guy open and ready to score. Durant with a screen on Gilgis Alexander. Booker finds Durant. Aiden with it. Fires the three. Gets the three to fall. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. The Thunder have gone one of four to begin this one. Outside, Williams. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. An example of the unique leadership of Gilgis Alexander. Getting the three points right back for them. Beal with it. Now guarded by Holmgren. Booker for three. On the wing, Durant. There's the three. Aiton passes to Durant. Over Williams. And another basket for Phoenix. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. Here's Gilgis Alexander, and Aiden pulls it down. Aiden's got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. The three is up. Hits the trifecta. Boy, I like their energy coming in. <laughs> Terrific execution so far. Couldn't come up with a much better start than this. They just have to keep it going. Kevin Durant has been leading the charge for the Suns. He put together 10 points in the quarter. We'll be right back with you shortly. to have you with us second quarter of basketball this game has not exactly been neck and neck but plenty of time left in this one and guys the sun's enjoying a nice lead here well it looks like hitting the boards hard was an emphasis of their attack they knew how valuable it was to do so yeah it's clearly a focus for them in this one and no question that all the second chance looks are paying off and gilgis alexander's got the ball here for the thunder they trail by 11. Next game against the Bulls at United Center. It'll be the front end of a two-game road trip. We've got Kenrich Williams, 
And it's Wiggins in at the small forward position. That's the group for Oklahoma City getting going in the second. Hey, you look at some of the young star power on OKC. Grant, they haven't had that since the Kevin Durant years. Oh, B.A., I mean, those KD teams were built through the draft. So no matter where they're picking, the Thunder seem to uncover gems. So it's Phoenix now. Now here's Gordon. Pass to Bowl. Three-pointer, Beal. Williams grabs the board. Gilgis Alexander against Beal. And Bradley Beal is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. Holmgren, he's checked in for Oklahoma City. Lou Dort comes in for Wiggins. Kevin Durant, he's checked in for Phoenix. Okogie comes in for Beal. Holmgren finds Williams. Inside, here's Dort. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. And clearly Dort knows how to operate inside, making his way to a high percentage shot. Bates D off the screen. Durant for three. Yes, sir! KD for three. Back-to-back -back threes, making their defense work on the perimeter a bit. Outside, Williams. And just about a minute and a half has passed here in the second quarter. Got it. Richard, when you were playing, what was your favorite offensive set to run? Ooh, back in the day, they used to call it drop three, where they would just bring the ball up to the side, let me catch it on the right block, and let me play one. That's what it used to be. Now, maybe it was the back cut. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Well, through all the stress and the turmoil of recent years, Bradley Beal's one of those players who was willing to open up and acknowledge the strain. He said, quote, it's OK to feel down, to talk about it, to be a human. A lot of times I think I'm a superhero or I can kind of figure things out on my own, but it's all right to rely on people. Brian? Yeah, you have to. It's all part of being a great teammate, no doubt. Thanks, Allie. Four on the clock from deep. Holmgren. Okogi pulls down the board. Phoenix has gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. For three, Durant. Another three for Phoenix. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Now here's Gilgis Alexander. Guarded closely. Here's Holmgren. Oh, it's blocked by Bull. His consistency just hasn't been there this quarter in terms of his shooting. Another three for Phoenix. Wow, their opponent is doing a tremendous job spacing the floor. Joe, pass to Williams. Outside, Gilgis Alexander. Will it go? Count it. Gilgis Alexander's got seven. We see this every night. He has the skill and versatility to keep a defense guessing. Oh, he oh, got it off in time! Wow. Your thunder. Whoa! The heave to it's beat the buzzer. Yeah, that's one in a hundred type shot. But hey, that is why you just throw it up there. And so it's the Phoenix Suns. Leading the quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it's been a runaway. You know, Kevin Durant has really been making it happen here, guys. Yeah, they've done an amazing job of creating room to operate for him. And then, of course, executing. I like how they came into this one with the game plan, and they're just going out and executing it. Terrific job. Second half underway. Here's who Frank Vogel's got on the floor. All the stars on the floor for the Suns. Booker and Beal, the backcourt, and KD up front. DeAndre Ayton is out there with Josh Okoge. For a star like him, you get lots of opportunities at the line, and he's great at cashing them in. Outside Durant puts up a three, and it's Kitty with a rebound. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. SGA working through contact inside. An exceptional finisher, and some contact like that won't stop Shea completely. Durant draws the double. Back to Booker. The three ball. The kick to Durant from the arc. Score it. 13 shots, nine makes. Solid. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Giddy passes to Gilgis Alexander. Taking it inside. SGA. 
And now almost all their points coming from the paint. Phoenix has gone 7 of 13 from downtown so far in this game. To the inside with a 9-footer. And there's Durant. That one's good. On the assist by Booker. Durant's got five points now in the quarter. Pass to Holmgren. Back to Giddy. And here's Gilgis Alexander. Shoots over Booker. Hey, Gilgis Alexander again. Gilgis Alexander's got 15. And he's doing everything he can offensively to lift them out of this hole. But I'm not sure his hot shooting can do it alone. Durant's shot is off. And you got to give credit to the D for never giving up on the play and doing just enough to bother him at the rim. And let's send it over to Ali LaForce. Hey, Brian, the Thunder are making dramatic improvement. Shea Gilgis Alexander, now an All Star, says they're gaining confidence. He said, quote, We know we're getting better. I think guys are kind of getting addicted to that feeling and continuing to grow. Brian, they could be building something really special here. Yeah, you're right. They could. Skipping no steps either. Thanks, Ali. Fires in the triple. Durant's got 30. Putting on a shooting clinic from deep. He had that huge first half, and he's still rolling. Outside, Williams. Giddy against Beal. Shoots from 12. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Aiden's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. Okogi, the pass to Booker. Three-pointer, Beal. Let's go with a three. Durant against Williams. Puts up a deep three. The Thunder pull it in. Would you say testing the limits of his range there? Yeah, he might have been feeling himself a little too much on that one. He can hit it, but not consistent. Pass to Gilgis Alexander. Off the mark with the outside fadeaway. Kevin Durant has been leading the charge for Phoenix. He's now hit six threes in this game. Knows he has the green light to fire away. Back to the game after this break. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. You know, I'm kind of stoked that this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. That wasn't a better pass in the game, almost like he had a sixth sense. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. In it forward, it's Dordan Williams. Shea Gilgis Alexander is out there with Josh Giddy, and it's Holmgren in at the center position. That's the lineup out there for the Thunder. It's turned into a showdown here, dueling from distance. Take that, he says. I see your three, and I'll raise you another three. And he gets it to go. Durant's got 13 points here in the second half alone. Okay, I'm going to tell you something that everyone knows or should know. When Durant turns it on, there is no slowing him down. That's how lethal of a scorer he is in NBA history. And Gilgis Alexander missing. Phoenix dominating the game. Beal, the pass to Booker. Fires for three. That's good from Durant on the assist from Booker. Booker's got three assists tonight. And this is how he shines. He's a big part of their floor space. Yeah, you got to know where he is at all times, especially when he's running around the perimeter ready to fire. And this is what makes SGA an all-star caliber talent, his ability to take over games. Booker. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. It's going to go on Chet Holmgren. Let's get a quick check of the scoring breakdown here for the Suns. Their offense has been a well-oiled machine. They're moving the ball around, playing for one another, and just piling up assists. Yeah, something else they're doing in this game is striking from long range. The defense just hasn't been able to keep them off the arc tonight. A line change here for Oklahoma City. And a new group getting ready for the Suns. Bowl, he's checked in for DeAndre Ayton. Bates Diop comes in for Durant. Gordon, he's checked in for Okogie. And it's Lee in for Bradley Beal. He gives up a bit of size at the center position, but his leaping ability, well, let's just say that makes up for it. 
They came out and had a statement win with their performance tonight. A fantastic effort to get it done here for the Suns. Seemed like the sheer volume of three-pointers today was the deciding factor. <laughs> and they'd hit one and then just dialed up again. And it worked. And so this win marks their first victory of the new year. It's just the start of this season series with three games left between them. But it must feel great to take the first meeting. And even the opposing fans can't deny this was a sensational game for Kevin Durant. And let's just say this, the name of the game is scoring, and yes, he provided that tonight. You're welcome. A minute six left to play in the fourth. Bold, the pass to Bates Diop. Durant against Wiggins. Now here's Durant. He's covered closely. Shoots over Wiggins. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right iron. Durant's got 40 points. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. And that score probably slams the door for any would-be comebacks. And look, they put this one to bed. <laughs> well, that was clearly a foul. First two fouls. At the line for two. The first one falls. So Oklahoma City going with almost an entire new group here. Holmgren, he's checked in for Williams. Williams comes in for Robinson Earl. Dort, he's checked in for Wiggins. And Gilgis Alexander is subbed in for Joe. Dort against Durant. Not watching the line there. That'll be a backcourt violation. Substitution on the court. 24 seconds left in the fourth. Pass to Robinson Earl. Here's Joe. This one for three. Williams. Great positioning on the putback. That's a pure effort play. Nice tip in. And that's a skill you see in any strong offensive rebounder, isn't it? So no problem for Phoenix as they get the win. Boy, this crowd has to be shocked by the way their team was dismantled. Shocked and surprised.